What's going on guys? Marcus Zar here and we're at Robinhood, specifically crypto.robinhood.com. And we all know that Robinhood is you know adding cryptocurrencies so we can actually trade uh, with 24-7 um, support and co commission free service. Um, so this is the website if you want to go check it out and sign up. This is exactly what I'm doing, so I can show you guys the exact process to sign up. For Robinhood, so you guys can start trading, you know, Bitcoin, Ethereum, you know, commission free. Um, I think that's the the big three they're going to start with. But I think it's really just Bitcoin and Ethereum. Um, it's only dedicated to Pacific states like California and the other couple other states in the United States. You know, they are planning on expanding, but for right now it's just limited to certain people in certain areas. So uh, if you want to get early access to it, you can by clicking down here and pinning your email and you can actually watch the video as well so you guys could you know be aware of everything once this process starts so with that said let's go ahead and sign up for Robinhood and see what it looks like inside so I'm on the sign up page so I'm gonna go ahead and get started um, I don't know anything about Robinhood you know Robinhood is you know mainly for like stocks and things of that nature so that's how I kind of heard about Robinhood before and um, you know I don't know how their whole setup is you know getting started and things of that nature so this is definitely new for me so I'm gonna go ahead and you know show you guys the whole process and it shouldn't be that hard you know but usually with cryptocurrency exchanges you know the exchange that I tra trade on is called Binance and or or Bittrex or or um, you know you got some other ones as well you know the whole sign up process is really simple you just need pretty much your password and your your email and your password that's pretty much it to get started with cryptocurrency trading so it seems like Robinhood is might be different I'm not sure but you guys gonna see me get started right now so I am gonna block everything for my you know personal privacy of course so let me go ahead and sign up put my first name in And I'm actually pretty excited, guys, to see how you know how the, how the interface looks inside of you know Robinhood. Hit continue. Not right now. So my address, they want all that stuff. We'll go ahead and put that in. Oops. Go ahead and hit continue. Verify your identity as a registered broker dealer. Robinhood is required by federal law, Patriot Act of 2001, to collect your social security number. So I don't, you know, have a problem with that. So I'm gonna go ahead and self-identify myself. I got this number cap lock on, so I'm gonna go ahead and take that off. That's why it's doing that. United States I'm single of course <laughs> stay that way for, for a while <laughs> number of dependents one my daughter uh, know what I'm doing I can say that appointment status you know actually let me see just make this simple I'm gonna go ahead and do that Never. So fund your account. In order to make trades with Robinhood, you will need to deposit funds into your account. Transferring funds in and out of your Robinhood account is free. There are no account minimums, which is great, right? We just want to get started and, um, you know, let, let's get this. Let, let's trade, right? 
uh, fund your account. Wish I could kind of skip this part. Let me see. Okay, so it looks like I need to fund my account, but right here, um, I don't see the bank that I use on this list. And it says right here, when you click on this little arrow right here, it says, what if you don't see um, your bank on, on this list? And it says right here, if you don't see your bank in this list, you can still fund your account from the Robinhood app by clicking here. And uh, right as we go down here, it says this process is free. There are no account minimums. Transferring funds can take up to three days. Robinhood Financial is a member of, you know, which protects customers up to $500,000. So I'm going to go ahead and click here since I don't see my bank account. I'm going to go ahead and submit my application so it could be up for review. Go ahead and read the um, terms and conditions and things like that. Instant settlement agreement. Check mark. See what other other agreements that's that's check mark already um, everything looks good um, I'm confident so I'm gonna go ahead and submit the application application submitted we are currently reviewing your application we'll email you as soon as it's approved or if we need additional information you can say copy your application here by clicking here if you have any questions in the meantime please um, visit the help center I'm gonna go ahead and um, continue to Robinhood I already got the email to my phone. You guys can't see it, but I did get a notification in my phone that's telling me to download the app. Um, and it looks like Robinhood is loading up. So it looks like this is the interface of Robinhood for the, I guess for the meantime until I get approved but this is the watch list for you know stocks and things like that um, I could go ahead and uh, fund my account by adding funds right here by doing it on my phone since my uh, bank wasn't listed on there you know since I have a credit union I don't use big banks I use credit unions um, looks like they have news and things of that nature what's going on um, looks pretty simple right don't look like nothing's really going on I don't know because I need to actually get approved with my ap application for me to see the whole interface so I'm gonna go ahead and you know play around with it I guess this is the home so I'm clicking home right there then you have the notifications when you have your fun your first dividend transfer or order it will show up in here my account Got my name, got the help, got the disclosures, and I can log log out if I want to. So right now, it's just pretty much a waiting game for everything to go through on uh, Robinhood, on Robinhood, you know, in. And so far, I don't see anything related to cryptocurrencies right now. Like I said, I am in California. You know, I'm in Sacramento, California, to be exact. So like I said, I. I don't really know what's going on until the whole application goes through but I was just showing you guys how easy and simple it was to get started with Robinhood um, I never signed up for Robinhood before but like I said I have experience signing up with accounts you know trading accounts you know like I said I trade on Binance and I had an account with Bitrix and you know uh, Coinbase and things like that so it the, the whole process looked like it was simple and Robinhood you know um, there's no minimum to fund my account to get started so like I said I it looks like I can't really do anything right now until I get approved so I'm gonna go ahead and click on this Apple stock just to see what's going on um, like it says right here you can start trading once your account is approved it looks you know the interface looks pretty pretty simple pretty basic um, you know definitely different from you know what what I'm used to, especially with cryptocurrencies, you know, the exchanges is is you know, it seems like a it's a lot more active as far as like a lot more options and things like that. So looks like Robinhood is, which is a good thing, right? 
uh, you know, they it seemed like they were taking the simple approach, which is, you know, definitely good. You know, simple is better. Um, like I said, I never did this. Robinhood was, you know, mainly for stocks, I believe, and they're trying to get in cryptocurrency. So as far as right now, I don't see anything. So I guess once I get checked out with my application, things like that, um, you know, we're going to go from there. I'm going to make another video and things like that. And then um, hopefully they got the crypto trading part, and I'll show you that too. Have a great one, guys. Marcus Zor.